Hello everyone, welcome to Wati. In this video today, we are going to teach you how you can easily make a bot flow um, with button and list message. So as you can see on the right, in the past, we have seen that uh, for template message, you can send a message with button. And now we have a new list message that you can click on the collapsed menu and offer different options for your client to choose. Let's take a look on how we can easily create it in Wati. So now, um, once you log into your Wati dashboard, you will see different tools on the top. And we need to go to automation. Right here, um, we will see the keyword action. Later on, we definitely need to come here to create a keyword to track the flow. So first of all, let's go to the flow to build our message with the button reply and also the list message. So um, what we can do here is that we can start from scratch um, adding a new flow and of course like you can choose from one of those template but today we are going to start from scratch and let's give them a name please test and we awesome so um, to start with um, you can see on the left you can either send a message ask a question to your client and set a condition so where you can find the button reply message or set a new list is the middle one, ask a question. And for the next one, you can simply ask a question to your client um, like in the past. And now we have these two new buttons here. Either you can add the buttons for your client to choose from and there will be limited um, three choice. So that will be the best to use for um, say yes, no question or any question that with um, options uh, within three and for the least message that will be better to use for let's say a menu or um, like you know if you have like you know, a great variety of options um, that is um, uh, less than 10 options that you can offer for your client to choose from so I'll give you um, a, an example um, say a food delivery okay so we're gonna ask the question to the client with the button first so um, let's say um, here uh, will be your question so we will change this one um, so that is like a simple question right um, are you our member then it's like either yes or no so I'm going to change the answer here for client to choose then it will be like yes or no that's super simple once I click create here that the option will change directly. So I'm going to save this. And the button, like the preview, will be um, showing directly here. So um, let's say you know, um, if they uh, put yes, then um, I'll redirect them to a menu to choose from. So I can take the least one. Then I can start creating a list. So I simply need to double click on this and you'll be able to show um, uh, to, to configure the, the list message. So um, you can offer, please choose your meal here. And um, for the button text, um, which is the left menu where we click on here, um, let's say a foot menu. Okay, um, just trying to demonstrate it and make things simple. And you can offer a different one. So in the list, it can be a whole list of um, like you know, similar options. For example, if you are selling a handbag, then you can uh, offer a list of different colors. Or in this case, let's say I would like to have different session on the menu, then I can offer um, um, session one as food, then um, I can add new session for drinks, let's say. And another session um, as um, add-on, for example. Add-on for, uh, for, I don't know, like if you have a meal, then you can eat, um, you can take the add-on of like salad or fries on the side or pasta. So um, for the food one, um, I'll probably say um, beef 
and you can see that the preview um, that will be directly showing on the on the left and create new fish new row um, chicken okay so let's say we create some options for food and then um, for drinks um, we can create um, okay so let's say some simple options like this and then um, add-ons um, I can put um, salad or fries okay so um, this look good and I'm going to save it right so um, now we have already um, made these two um, button message and the list message within the flow of course I like, um, after they have different options you can redirect them to um, other choice as well or um, other um, question as well to complete the whole flow but um, as a demonstration now we're going to save the flow and see um, how it will look like once your customer trigger this to um, this message so as we can see now um, we have create a flow as a list test and now um, once we save it we can go back to automation to add the trigger what I will do now is I'll go back to the keyword action Add a new keyword to trigger this flow um, for your customer. So first of all, I'll add a new, a new keyword. Um, say using the same name. And save it. For the next step, let's go to the flow and find our least test flow. Select this one. Awesome, so once we save it, that will go live. Um, once people click on this um, least test keyword, the least test flow will be, check, uh, will be triggered. Okay, so let's see how it looks like on the phone right now. I am going to um, share my phone screen as well so um, we can all see it together. Okay, so now um, let me go back to the flow. And together with my phone screen, uh, we'll be able to see this um, flow in action. Okay, so now we can go back to the flow and um, you can see my phone on the screen. So you can see the flow in action. So first of all, we set the keyword as least test. It's going to trigger this flow that we just created together. And they will ask you um, if I'm a member. So, um, I only take the yes and link to the list message so I'll click on yes and then they will ask me to choose the meal from here and once I tap on the food menu it's going to show me a list of options here that I can choose from and also if you can see here the food one uh, that is corresponding for the session so you can see the session will actually separate by a gray line and you will have different options here so let me, uh, let's say if I put um, I don't know, fish then once I tap on send it will be auto reply right so this is how you can easily create your flow with um, button and list message that actually create a better user experience for your client that they don't need to type anything and they simply need to click on the options that you provide there um, that will have like first of all um, the button message will have 40% better reply rate compared to the text message and also it can guarantee that your flow works perfectly because you can prevent that the client will probably have a typo or they um, simply you know type the message wrongly and your flow did not get to the point that um, they, they could complete so thank you so much for watching this video I hope you find it useful I will see you in the other Wati videos. Thank you. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you want more content from Wati, please like and comment below and hit the subscribe button. Thank you.